The ant and the grasshopper. Are you living in the moment? In a field one summer's day a grasshopper was hopping about, chirping and singing. An ant passed by, bearing along with great toil an ear of corn he was taking to the nest. Why not come and chat with me, said the grasshopper, instead of toiling and moiling in that way. I am helping to lay up food for the winter, said the ant, and recommend that you do the same. Why bother about winter, said the grasshopper, we have got plenty of food at present. But the ant went on its way and continued its toil. When the winter came the grasshopper had no food and found itself dying of hunger, while it saw the ants distributing everyday corn and grain from the stores they had collected in the summer. Then the grasshopper knew. It is best to prepare for the days ahead. As you can see the moral of the story is about the virtues of hard work and planning for the future. In Luke 12 13 to 21 the parable of the rich fool we see the same flawed thinking. Just like the grasshopper the rich man decided to take it easy and to eat, drink and be merry. He was living in the present moment with no thought to his future eternal life. As my father used to say, live each day as if it were your last and one day you will be right. We don't know when this earthly life will end but we are certain that at its end the eternal life will begin. In Matthew 6 19 to 21 Jesus speaks concerning treasures. Do not lay up for yourselves treasures on earth, where moth and rust consume and where thieves break in and steal. But lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven, where neither moth nor rust consumes and where thieves do not break in and steal. For where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. People often have a choice between earthly activities or property and those that store up greater future rewards in heaven. As we see in today's reading the consequences of making the wrong choice can be eternally disastrous. If, as in the case of the rich man, you do not have the time to correct the errors of your past life. 